I'm Rob Croxall. I'm the president and brewer at El Segundo Brewing Company. I happened into a home brewing kit, came back and made a pale ale and probably the worst thing that ever, but I thought it was great. And then it was like, oh, I could totally do this. I clearly did the most of IPAs because that's really just where my heart is. I mean, that's the kind of beer I like, so that's what I made the most of. Rob always Rob wanted to do hoppy beer, and I thought, Nobody in LA is doing hoppy beer. At the end of the day, when I want a beer, I want a pale ale. That's what I really want. Generally, I want like, something kind of hoppy and refreshing and dry. In my last job, there was a layoff coming up and uh, they were gonna have me lay off some of my staff. So I went to my boss and said, you know, I'm out of here in February anyway, so. Came down to El Segundo, tasted his home brews and said, if you could, if he could make these beers on a production level, then I could sell them. You know, El Segundo is home. My wife, you know, also grew up here. Um, so this is really the only place I wanted to do it. Uh, I didn't even look anywhere else. Maybe five years ago, four years ago, there really wasn't very many places. Actually, it was really only the Richmond was the only place in town to really go get a good beer. Now, Rock and Brews, of course, across the street, that has a really good selection of handles. And, you just see the demographic here really coming around to the craft beer scenes. And we have you know, a couple different ways of doing things that we hope are something that hasn't been done. You know, the White Dog has got 50% wheat. We're just, we're just hopping the hell out of it. Even if it's a little less geeky, uh, people drink lots of IPA. Beer Belly, one night stand. El Segundo Brewing. Be there! <laughs> That's it. I think we're done. That's a wrap. <laughs>